हेलो फ्रेंड्स नाउ वी विल लर्न हाउ टू डेवलप डाटा कलेक्शन प्लान डाटा कलेक्शन इज ए प्रोसेस डेट यू नीड टू मैनेज एंड इम्प्रूव जस्ट लाइक एनी अदर प्रोसेस योर मेजरमेंट एंड डाटा विल बी ओनली एज गुड एज द प्रोसेस डेट कलेक्टेड डाटा कलेक्शन इन्वॉल्व फोर स्टेप्स दैट इज एग्री द ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड गोल डेवलप ऑपरेशनल डेफिनेटिव एग्री ग्राउंड रूल्स डेट यू कलेक्ट डाटा इज वैलिड एंड कंसिस्टेंट कलेक्ट द डाटा नो द फर्स्ट पॉइंट इज एग्री द ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड गोल्स सो फर्स्ट यू हैव टू आइडेंटिफाई द सी टी क्यू कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स फॉर विच द डाटा टू बी कलेक्टेड एज आई टोल्ड यू अर्लियर सी टी क्यू इज क्रिटिकल टू क्वालिटी दैट इज द कस्टमर रिक्वायरमेंट so everyone in the team should understand why they are measuring and what they are measuring so for example understand the voice of customer is i want part in 5 days so ctq is 5 days that is delivery time so voice of the process is on an average is take 6 days so average performance is 6 days that means the customer requirement not met even if the average performance is 5 days but it would not be good enough because the customer sees every cycle not the average operational derivative are used to avoid any misunderstanding in this who what where when and how of the measurement system is defined so what what we are measuring why we are measuring how do we collect data and record when do we collect data where is in the process who will collect the data these are all the things are described in a sheet so there is a true story the 1999 launch of nasa mars is a famous example of murky definitions this 125 million rocket was designed to investigate if water had existed on the red planet unfortunately the rocket disappeared never to be seen again this cause was rather embarrassing the team that built a spacecraft and managed its launch worked in bits and inches but the team responsible for landing the craft on mars work in metric system and no one had thought to convert the data as a result the angle of the entry into mars was too short and rocket burned up so by this example you came to know how important is to define the operational derivative again third one is ground rules in this msa is to be used that is measurement system analysis to avoid any variation in your data so msa is overall approach to ensure the validity of the measurement gauge r and r is a technique for assessing the repeatability and reproducibility of the measuring system repeatability is the measure of the variation seen when one operator uses the same system to measure same thing reproducibility is the measure of the variation seen when different operator uses the same system to measure same thing now the last one is collect the data so check sheet is best completed in time sequence that's why check sheet is always preferred to collect the data this is a basic check sheet of collecting of defect on daily wise basis